two game sports for Wednesday night action in the NBA. Hi everyone, Kevin Holland, joined by Steve Kerr and Mark Miller. You can feel the energy here in the Bradley Center. The Bucks looking to please their fans in this Eastern Conference matchup. All right, presented by State Farm. Let's take a look at the Miami starting five. Their dynamite trio of Dwayne Wade, LeBron James, and Chris Bosh at two through four. Chalmers is out there with Chris Anderson. And for the Bucks, Brandon Jennings and Monte Ellis comprise the deck. Ilya Silva and Allen are down low. And it's Mbappe Mute in at the three. It'll be the heat off the tip. Chalmers with it. There's the pick. Right side, Bosch. Back to Chalmers. Wait outside. LeBron James on the wing. Five on the clock. Over and by Mucha. LeBron shot is off. Man man defense. They are really pleased with the victory on Monday. And they drew so many fouls in that game, guys. That was one area that really stood out when you watched it. Yeah, guys, to me, that was just a case of lack of discipline on the other side. I can't say any more than that on it. Great defense in the game there, making it tough on the offense. That's what he brings. The I mean, you saw it on that miss. Well, it's the best possible play there. That was an easy two, so instead of fouling, they can shoot things. That's right. A smart, strong foul there. No and ones and no dunks. Gets one, and this is the second attempt from the free throw. And at last, they get one to fall. Can't allow that to happen, guys. Just a, a defensive breakdown there on the boards. I was with it. Wade picks him up. There's the bucket pitch. That's going to be important for this team to fight over the top of screens defensively. Yeah, you got to tag him and stay right close to him because with this touch, he doesn't need much space to get a shot. And now Doris Burke has an update from the sidelines. Kevin, I was able to speak with Eric Spolster for a moment. What he stressed to his team in the locker room was that they can't go into this game thinking they've got room for error just because they'll have another chance to close it out in their building should they lose. He said that would be the absolute worst possible mindset for us. We'll know early how they're thinking, guys. And thanks for that story, Doris. Jennings kicks to D'Alembert. The shot's good. Jennings making the ball. The Heat have gone three of four from the field to start the game. Ray dishes to Chalmers. Back to Ray. Lead left side. Let Trey. The rebound by the Bucks. And off the court from the Bucks. On the break. Here's Elias Silva. And he gets off the fast break with a monster slam. Two hands for safety. One hand if you want major elevation. <laughs> That's right. That's right. You know you can get up higher with one hand. I did not know that. It really is true. I mean, you can extend better with one. Well, whatever he did, whatever whatever it was, it definitely worked, Clark. Here is Jennings after the main shot from Dwayne Wade. And the whistle blows on the backcourt violation. He went over and back. Wade left side. And the Heat got another bucket right there. He doesn't need to fade away on that move. He can go straight up, make it an easier shot. Bucks trail by five. Jennings picks to Ilias Oka. It's back to Jennings. Feeds it to D'Alembert. That falls. Great assist by Brandon Jennings. First quarter in the middle, about three minutes in. Here's Wade. That's good and so Chalmers with the assist. Chalmers has got his third assist on the night. Well, he's got the special ability, Kevin, to make shots while being heavily guarded. And I don't know how he does it, but he figures out a way to get the ball in the basket, even under pressure. And he also loves to jump into the passing lanes and pick you off. I mean, he likes to shoot the gap. Backfires on occasion, but like a great base runner, he seems to pick his spots pretty well. Strong first quarter. He's really made the most of his opportunities. Some changes in for the Bucks. Larry Sanders has checked in for Dallenberg. Daniels comes in for Mbamuta. And J.J. Redick is subbed in for Monte Ellis. And a new group in for the Heat. Giannis Hazel is checked in for Anderson. Patio comes in for LeBron. 
Ray Allen, he's checked in for Dwayne Wade. And it's Morris Cole in for Mario Chalmers. Oh, he didn't buy three. It's Allen on the way. Out to Battier. He gets to Cole. Tries again. Gets it to go. Cole's got his first two points of the night. There's 57 seconds left in the first quarter of the game. Jennings gets to Reddick. A three ball, and the shot is good. He have gone 8 of 11 in the first quarter. They'll take that percentage anyhow. Cole, the pass to Bosch, drills the elbow jumper. He's, he's as close to impossible to defend as anybody, I think. I mean, he can just torch the defense in so many ways. And there's the call on the down the that's his first foul. And the Bucks with some changes. Udo comes in for Ilyasova. And it's Ellis in for Brandon Jennings. And then for Miami, LeBron is checked in for Bosch. Wade comes in for Ray And it's Chalmers in for Norris Cole. Right out of the gate, just filling it up. Both teams are, guys. I mean, one's coming fast and furious. Bucks trail by four. Just one second between the shot clock and game clock. And stolen by Chalmers. Rolls it up high. Has him. That's good. I can imagine they're going to hear an earful about this next stop. I mean, that's three straight field goals given up right in the middle of the lane. Inexcusable. Now, defense starts at the rim. I mean, you want teams shooting the ball from the outside. They're just giving up everything inside. And the power for one hand shot. You know, the dunk was great, but I didn't care for that interior defense there, guys. It was non-existent. You're right, Mark. You know, it was way too easy. I don't think the coach <laughs> either. Look at it. <laughs> and they're scoring.